any pop here. I think I'll buy some. My dad and his girlfriend, they really don't drink that much pop. I really don't either. But I like, like Gatorade and Powerade, I drink that a lot. Like juice. Like yesterday I bought a thing of Simply Lemonade, and that shit's awesome. Love me some lemonade. Some of that. I drank it all earlier. <laughs> I was drinking some tea earlier, but I don't know if it has caffeine in it. Because I know some tea does. I don't know if it does or if it did or not. That's compensability frames. Hell yeah. I love the games with invincibility frames. Especially E Honda's headbutt in Street Fighter 4. Shit is off the chain. I guess I should probably cut this video and put it on YouTube before I go to bed. I'll probably do that. So I think I just need to split the video in two parts. Let me cut out a little bit at the beginning. And cut a little bit at the beginning and where I took my break will be the first video and then the second video will be the rest of this. Splash cold water. <coughs> I burped. Bloop, 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 bloop. Chipokamon! Do you like Chipokamon? Yeah. Then you like Alabama Man. Alabama Man. I love Old South Park. Old South Park's awesome. Okay, so that one doesn't go up. Oh, it's just one. Oh, there's a life up there. That's right. Checkpoint two. I wonder what they got the idea of a bandicoot that runs around and breaks up the crates. And he likes to eat fruit. And also, where did they get the idea to give him blue pants? An alpha. I should check that out. That oh, I can't jump on him. That Crash Bandicoot one prototype. I should check that out sometime. That sounds pretty interesting. Ch Ching, forty-one lives. At least the lives in this game aren't as easy to get as in New Super Mario Brothers two for 3DS. Extra lives are so easy to get in that game. It's ridiculous.
They added crates to fill up space. That's funny. I bet they put gems into the first crash just to give you something to collect, I bet. Give you at least something to do besides just running up and jumping and avoiding obstacles. Ah, oh, I got bodied right there. Shish kebab. you that time. Alright. Save and we'll beat this guy. Any you guys played uh, Crash Bandicoot Huge Adventure for Game Boy Advance? That game was pretty fun. I liked it. We was made by Vicarious Visions. I liked it a lot. Oh, I forgot you have to like chase him and hit the boulders at him. Or not the boulders, but the asteroids at him. I forgot that's how you beat him. Then if you don't get beat him, uh Or maybe you don't have to hit the boulders at him. Maybe not. Maybe you just have to reach him and Okay, I think you just reach him. If he gets to the end of the, uh, the tunnel in time, then you have to restart. Yeah, at least I can't die, but... I ain't gonna make it, I think I gotta retry again. Come back here, piece of shit. Ah, fuck. Alright, I lost. <laughs> All right, I got 38 more tries to go. Ah, I'm not close enough. Sometimes it's kind of hard to tell if you're right next to him or not when you're like going up. Okay, I don't have to spin the rocks. I must be thinking of a different game where you have to, like, spin rocks. See, I can't tell if I'm... Ah, oh, fuck!
See, I can't tell that well if I'm actually right next to him or not. Damn it! Ah, I fail. Or not, I got him. No! You haven't seen the last of me, Crash Bandicoot! Suppose happened to Cortex. And what about the Cortex Vortex? It's still up there. <gasps> it has Naughty Dog on it, that's funny. Well, there is my any percent playthrough of Crash Bandicoot 2 Cortex Strikes Back Is there anything at the end of the credits? I can't remember. I'll just let him go. <sighs> Hopefully you guys liked my terrible playthrough of this game. I used to think this game was so long as a kid, but I beat it in like like two and a half hours, close to three hours. Probably well, Scott's the final or the boss, anyways. Let we'll the credits rock, and then we'll see if there's anything after the credits. He was really bad compared to this run. Uh, I should get some rest, I should. But I'm gonna probably at least try to put this on YouTube before I go to bed. And I just, when you upload to YouTube, it's just like the stream. So like what you guys are watching on your end is exactly what goes up on YouTube. So me talking and not my commentary, everything will be on the video. Man, I'm going to try to upload more of my streams to YouTube. 97 this game came out? So is that when I got PS1 or was it 90? So when did Crash Bandicoot 3 come out? God, I don't remember. I'm going to be YouTube famous. Oh yeah, my shitty ass run of this game. <laughs> Alright, well, thanks for watching the videos on YouTube, and thanks for watching the live stream, if you're there in the live stream. If you want to catch my streams, you can check me out at twitch.tv slash jjor64. If you'd like to follow me on Twitter, it's twitter.com slash jjor64. Um, I'm trying to think what else I can plug. I'm on GiantBomb.com, like, all the time. So I'm the same username on there as well. Was it? 98? So maybe I did get a PlayStation and this game in 97. Because I remember I rented Crash Bandicoot 3 and beat most of it before I got it that Christmas. Uh, nah, fuck Facebook. I don't like Facebook. <laughs> That's what I think about Facebook. Follow me on Twitter, not Facebook. I do have a Facebook, but I'm not going to add you if you add me in there. I never use Facebook. In MySpace. <laughs> I don't think I ever made a MySpace. I think I made a MySpace. I had it for like a week or something, and I deleted it, I think. But yeah, thanks for watching, guys, and I will catch you next time.